Success is something you attract by the person you become. Success is something you attract by the person you become. Once I understood that, then I knew what to work on. I used to work on my boss. Work on yourself. I'd never heard that kind of language before. And this kind of language. I wish to pay fair price for what paying will make of me. See, being able to pay is far more valuable than paying and getting something. Getting something is the minor value. Becoming something is the major value. Once I understood that, my life exploded into change. So, these little refinements of philosophy has so much to do with how your day goes. It has so much to do with your ability to pick up the challenge. So much to do with your ability to refine your own thinking, refine your procedures, develop your disciplines, become more valuable each day. Twice as valuable this year than last year. Three times as valuable next year as this year. You can go on a quest of personal development and acting in your own self-interest. It is colossal information. I'm so glad it came my way because I did operate in the dark for a long time until some of this stuff became clear. Start a new process of learning. Sign up for a class and commit yourself to a new degree. Commit yourself to a new skill. And all you got to do is take your first class and you can say, I'm on a new track. I will be multi-talented. I will be multi-skilled. When I get ready to apply for some kind of employment in the 21st century, they'll say, what can you do? And you can say, almost everything. <laughs> what do you got? <laughs> What's available? We all enjoy the person who goes to work and says, are there some classes I can take here? I know I'm just getting started, but is there a class I can take? Is there something I can do to grow? How could I become twice as valuable in the next 12 months to this company? You don't see people like that very often, but those that commit to that kind of dedication, we welcome them with open arms and say, come on in. This is a rare person to find. Committed and dedicated to developing themselves in their own self-interest so that they can bless others. To help you, I must be strong. To help you out of the ditch, I must get out of the ditch. To help you that are in welfare, I must get off welfare. To get you off, I got to get off. I got to find some ways to strengthen myself. Once I become strong, I can reach back now and give you a helping hand and help you to change and have the dignity of learning step by step to deserve it. Here's what we teach in leadership. Learn to work with the people who deserve it, not the people who need it. Learning to work with the people who deserve it, not the people who need it. But here now is the responsibility of leadership, showing people how to deserve it. One of the places to start is with your family. Show your kids how to deserve your time, how to deserve your attention. Show your kids how to deserve the money. Kid said, I need $20. Say, that's not how we talk in this house. Oh, yes, I forgot. Tell me some ways I can earn $20. Now, $20 is easy. Ain't no problem around here with $20. But all you got to do is deserve it, not need it. Plenty of money for those that deserve. Plenty of return for those that qualify. Plenty of income in the marketplace for those in a growing way who develop themselves, become more valuable this year than last year. That's where the key is. You don't need to wait for a raise. Raise yourself. Raise your standards. Raise your commitment. Raise your discipline level. You don't have to worry about a raise. Success is attracted to those that are constantly on a growing scale. You say, well, does a man deserve $200 million for one year's work? And the answer is yes. If you help the company make $4 billion, would they give you $200 million? And the answer is easy. Easy. Learning to think in larger numbers and hoping that you can qualify. Here's what it's called in, in human language. And that is, we all have the ability to aspire. Aspire. That's a unique human word. You couldn't use it for a crocodile. A spider. Spiders don't aspire. 
They're driven. 